death actually means just giving up uh, our present body and accepting another body that is uh, in so many verses krishna explained this in bhagavad gita dehi no asmin jatha dehe komarang jovanang jara tatha dehantara prapti dhiras tatra namuhyati so dehi and deha body and the owner of this body we have this body this body is a uh, subject to destruction this is the made of five matters uh, this is the material body so but within this body there is soul who is a uh, immortal so soul is not dying only the body is dying so that's why all living entities they pass through different stages like is uh, their young age then gradually they become they accept the old old the uh, old age their body from begins from the child uh, become a small child then gradually the body grows and finally become a young then become old finally has to leave the body so after leaving this body soul again if he is according to his desire desires is uh, forced to accept another body just like in a practical life we see when we wear a cloth and this cloth become uh, old and it destroyed is subject to be destruction so we accept a new cloth similarly the living entity also when he saw this this body now become old it is no more uh, helpful for him to uh, fulfill his uh, desires his sense gratification then the soul being immortal he gave up the old body and he accept a new body so there is death and birth birth and death cycle is there unless one become completely desireless free from all material desires uh, he has to accept one body after another so there is another body after death 